Former F1 driver Felipe Massa was a Ferrari driver for nine years and even fought for the championship in 2008 with them. He has now spoken candidly to Globo and discussed, among other things, whether Ferrari did the right thing by choosing not to renew Sebastian Vettel's contract after this year. I'm your host Dylan Shelley and first up on Formula World, were Ferrari right to let Vettel go? Massa began by summarising the racing in F1 so far in 2020. We had nice races like Monza and Mugello too, different things like Gasly's victory. I think everyone was rooting for him. But this is another year in which Hamilton has dominated and doing an exceptional job. He then quickly turned his attention to Ferrari's predicaments this year. To see such an important team suffering in this way is very sad. Nobody wants to see Ferrari having these problems. Massa followed that up by revealing whether Ferrari made the right call by not extending Sebastian Vettel's contract. Vettel's time has passed, so much so that his results this year show that Ferrari may have taken the right option not to renew his contract. He then looked at Vettel's replacement, Carlos Sainz. Sainz is a good driver, young and has a lot to grow as well. Of course, they need to have a competitive car before anything, but I have hope for his sake and for Ferrari's. He concluded his words by highlighting the special place Ferrari holds for him. It is an exceptional team. I have a great affection and without a doubt different from the others, as if it were a religion. Fast feed. The FIA has revealed that they have conducted a total of 44,101 tests and nine people have tested positive so far this year. Renault's Daniel Ricciardo has divulged that since leaving Red Bull, the rivalry between him and Max Verstappen has mellowed out and they get on pretty well now. His teammate Esteban Ocon feels that the difference in performance between himself and Ricciardo is in the choices they make in terms of setup. Felipe Massa feels that defending world champion Lewis Hamilton has his way of drawing attention to certain topics, and if he does this for a good cause, it is only right that he does it. Former F1 driver Jolian Palmer has pointed out that finally, a drive to the podium for Red Bull's Alex Albon was not ended by contact with Lewis Hamilton. Red Bull team, team principal Christian Horner has explained that Albon is a gritty racer and knows how to get his elbows out, which is one of the reason he is a Red Bull driver. He also stated that Alpha Tauri are now more of a sister team rather than a junior team, so their aspirations are slightly different. Therefore, having a driver with experience and talent like Pierre is working well in that environment. MotoGP rider Valentino Rossi thinks that it is a great pity that the relationship between Ferrari and Sebastian Vettel has become so bad that it is coming to an end. He also explained how they've been twice close to a championship, but each time they haven't won. It's bad to see the current situation where the car is just too slow. He further feels that Vettel is still a top driver and can show his speed at Aston Martin. Mercedes team principal Toto Wolff finds the idea of rotating the European races at different venues an interesting new concept. He, however, added that the promoters have to make money from ticket sales and doesn't know if it will work for them if they are on the calendar one year and not the next. And McLaren team principal Andreas Seidel thinks that multiple triple headers are not sustainable as the mechanics will choose to do something else. Is AlphaTauri a true sister team to Red Bull, as opposed to just being a junior team? Head over to my community page to vote in the poll and let me know what you think in the comments. And if you liked this video, feel free to subscribe and check out my others for all the latest in the world of Formula 1.